Welcome back to Nostalgia Bros. Spoilers! I just gotta keep running. What the fuck? That's it. I'm done. Woo! Oh, I hate this game. We're done here. Three, two, one. Hey guys, welcome back. Welcome back, Martin. Uh, where we find out the secret of Queen Goma. Is it a hot lady? Uh, it's like a giant I hope it pseudo is. spider. It's oh, like a queel egg where she's hot from the top up. Yeah, yeah, I like it. And? Actually, she's just all ugly. I'll be the judge of that. Is that it? It's that thing. It's just an eye with legs. Oh my god. Gosh, that is armored arachnid. Okay, would not do. Let's just put it that way. Oh my god. Oh, yeah, I gotta shoot it in the eye. Kill it with fire. Break out your torch. No, you just gotta hit it in the face. And it's like, what's your face? Oh my it god, stab Zelda. it in the eye. It has the Zelda stabby, formula. Stabby, stabby, stab in the eye. Oh god, that you know, You know the great Zelda formula. Use the weapon you get in the dungeon to beat the thing. I wish life were so simple. Yeah. You always have the tool appropriate at hand. Yeah. Wait, Troy. You forgot there's more to the Zelda formula. So it's use the use the item that you you get in the dungeon. Hit it in its weak spot. For maximum damage. For three or four sometimes times in a row. Three or four sometimes times. I would really prefer to get a heart right now. I got plenty of bullets, guys. Equals win game always. And forever. You and mean forever. Equal, equals three? I mean, That's well, what the kids are talking about these days, right? Oh, yeah. Not v those veins. You know, the veins, right? Kids, and they're Young kids. They're enactments after seeing something. Okay, let's talk about what the fuck, like slang terms kids are using nowadays. They're using "young" to refer to something as cool. Like, well, young man, don't you feel that? Way? Like, check out these shoes that I bought, man. They're so young. Like, why? Why is that cool if it's young? Like, isn't that kind of creepy? Is it is it just like supposed to be like a uh, synonym for like, uh, like, like fresh? I guess so, but I don't know. It's just it's just weird. I am too far removed from from high school to really care about what's cool. I just see it. I just see it how I see it now. Yeah. Uh, if something's young, that means it's like. Infantile. Yeah, see, yeah, it's essentially no so longer. So if you call something young, I'm just like, yo, you're a creep. Yeah, see, like, you're a past... straight creep if you call your shoes young. In the past, like, year, I think, like, the last person that was on my Facebook that was from high school, like, graduated finally. So I no longer get posts about high school. Everyone's pregnant, though. Everybody. Or at least already has a kid. And they're posting pictures with their kid. Yeah. Yeah, I have a couple of those on my Facebook. I don't know what to think about that. I really see, don't. You see, okay. I see them with their kid, and then literally, like, the next week, they're just out partying. Yeah, that's that's kind of like the... Like, that's where the Duke of Truth dies. Oh, my God. He turns gray. You know what that reminds me of? That, uh... That 23-year-old uh, single mother who killed her child and decided to go partying. Because she wanted to party more. <laughs> like, are you kidding me? See, you made a terrible choice because of partying and then resulted in the kid. You should probably think a little harder next time. See, and it's kind of it's, it's kind of unfair because women are always the one that are held with the responsibility. But there's also a lot of single mothers on my Facebook. So it's like, and then you're like, some dude was just like, actually, you're on your own. Yeah. That whole thing where I was like, I had a latex allergy. Yeah, didn't think I'd have a kid. Uh, if you have a latex allergy, get non-latex -latex condoms. Exactly. 
Is it really that hard to figure it out? Like, why would you ever want to it's, have a kid when you don't want to have a kid? Exactly. It's just, <laughs> it's just very big douchebags is oh, Jesus. the simplest way. Because Marty has an actual latex allergy. Yeah. And like we just said, you can buy special condoms. Mm-hmm. Oh, look. That's not Din, though. That's a Gallic gun. That's Nehru. The blue one. Oh, it looks like an Oscar. It is a... It's the great Oscars. The great Oscars. Yeah, this is what... When Leonardo DiCaprio actually wins an Oscar, this is what it's going to be. It will just descend from the sky. And then, yeah, just... In a blue blaze, just down into his hands. And a single tear from Leonardo DiCaprio will be shed. And he'll die at that time. He will die a happy man. Yeah, he will just, like, there... At that point, he will die. He actually stands there holding the statue, Mm -hmm. and then he turns into an Oscar right there. Yeah, and he becomes the Oscar that is passed down to other other Oscar winners. Exactly. And soon then he will ascend into the heavens, and then he drops down like one, and then it's like those like little like Russian dolls that go into each other of people holding Oscars. Oscarception. Exactly. That'd be pretty sweet. It'd make for a good story. That that'd probably make the news for a few weeks. <laughs> <laughs> man, a, man turns into Oscar. Yeah. And then in other news, ostrich that escapes from the Toronto Zoo yeah. starts jumping across rooftops. Oh, hey, look, Toblerone. Yeah, exactly. You, you all know what the true goal of Legend of Zelda is, right? Get, get, the get that Tobler- Toblerone. I used to be so obsessed with that chocolate. I'm actually not the biggest fan of it. Also, it's, it's too solid, man. I'm it's not like... the biggest fan of chocolate. You know what's the best chocolate? What? Kinder Surprise. Yes. Oh my god, that is a top tier chocolate. Like, it's I don't know a what they put in. small thing. It looks so shitty. <laughs> and then you eat it and you're like, yes. And it's just happiness. And I think it's because it's a mix of, because it's a, like a milk chocolate outside with a white chocolate inside. And nostalgia. Yeah, and then you get a toy, and then we put those toys up in our, at the front here. Yeah. That was crack for kids. Chocolate and a toy inside. Exactly. Like, and in the states, fuck. they're like, "You're so dumb. We're outlawing this because your kids will eat the whole thing at once without like, thinking, and they'll choke." And then you're like, "If you asked me for like uh, to kill somebody and offered a box of Kinder Surprise, I would think about it. <laughs> I, would, I would deeply consider. I'm sure in the end I would say no, but I would be like, "Yo, if I just kill this person, and if nobody knew." And I had, like, a year's worth of Kinder Surprise. What's a year's worth, though? You really gotta consider how much you would eat at one time. Uh, well, every, every second of every day. Just, just a room filled. I would just lose all my teeth. Just this entire room physically filled with Kinder yeah. Egg. That'd be a lot. Yeah. I could My fridge fil- filled with Kinder Surprise. Like, imagine just walking in this room and you'd actually have to walk, like, you have to wade through, like, Kinder Eggs. And toys. You have so many toys. toys. Oh yeah, you'd probably have like complete sets at one point. Oh that's yeah, the, that was the sure. only thing. Is like you'd open it and you're like, oh, I got the other one. Yeah, it never makes any sense. I entreat you. Entreat? Do we get treats? It's a Kinder Egg. It's falling from his. Oh, catch it! Don't let it touch the ground. He's dying. Oh my God! What is happening to his skin? He's dying. Oh, okay. Rip in peace. Yeah. GG. Um, scrub. <laughs> <laughs> or should Sorry. I say shrub? We did the best. Yeah. Hey! Right. You're not even a real tree. Yeah, it's just two mustaches. Yeah. Oh, man. All right. So I we love, did our best. Yeah. Like I love the, like, competitive trash talk in games now. Oh, yeah? It's finally gotten to such a level that it's, like... Because, like... When I when we used to do it, like you'd be so salty and you'd be like, "Oh, you fucking gay lord!" And then you're like, "No, that's just regular insults that you use on other people." Now it's like, now like trash talk has its own entire lingo. Yeah, now it's a meme. Now trash talk is a meme. Now that's exactly. so like, okay, uh, you have you ever run across like the press one, the press one meme? No. Oh, it's like uh. Let's say if somebody just gets wrecked and it was, and usually the commentator would say like, "Press one if you feel bad for this person," and you don't. The commentator doesn't even need to say it anymore. It's just 
in the chat, everybody just throws out their ones. And you know. You know. It's just funny. Talk. It's funny trash talk. It's nothing too serious, at yeah. least, you know, in my experience. I think the biggest... So it's just funny. The biggest, it wasn't even trash talk. Me, me and my buddies were playing League. Did she just give you a kidney? Yeah. What the fuck? You gotta blow on it. It what? also worked a lot of money on the black market. Yeah. <laughs> God damn it. Link's got these fucking nice shiny stones and body parts. Yeah, is Link some sort of, like, black market dealer? To people who've never... No, don't know what this game is about. They never grow older, so maybe they just replace their parts. Oh god, wouldn't that be creepy? Yeah, but yeah. So uh, the big thing in like, so what happened in league was like I was just spectating because I was about to join, but my buddies were playing and they were just getting wrecked by this team. And right before the enemy team was about to kill them, the enemy team surrendered. Oh. And shit. then in the all chat after that. the game, they said, "Listen, you're probably gonna need that win of the day." Oh, oh. <laughs> just fucking was like, oh, so burnt. Yeah. And then I, 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 I screen capped it and put it in our group chat. Uh, and I saw that. I was like, oh, God, you guys just got ruined. Yeah. <laughs> so oh, now God. we always joke about that. We, we wanted to do it to a team, like a team sometime, but we're like, oh, it's pretty mean. Yeah. But yeah, you just surrender. It's like the, oh, the final insult. <laughs> and then you just let them know that you don't need that one of the day. <laughs> That's pretty funny. Oh man, yeah, but it's just gotten, it's gotten to like a new level. Like it's like it's just like, there, there's like certain like, like there, you don't need to resort to like you know swearing at someone or calling someone like obscenities or offensive words anymore. Yeah. yeah. Like you can like that's definitely the. It's about your actions in the game. Yeah, or just style. The disrespect. Yeah. We call that disrespect, guys. Exactly. You know. Because it's like a more honorary game, right? Yeah. Just, we're not trying to be derogatory. We're just trying to be disrespectful. Yeah, we just let you know that you are trash at the yeah. game. The key <laughs> yeah. is in respect, but add the D-E in front, and that's how you know how to you know do good trash talk. Exactly. But yeah, we should get good at that. Yeah. See, the thing is, like, you have to be so good at a game, though, that you can always confidently like be like, I can beat you. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. For sure. I mean, that's like one of the hardest things. Like you can try or just try to do something completely risky, and if it works out, fucking amazing. But if not, it's all right. I did it. But see, unless you're like, unless you're like a well-known player, no, it doesn't you matter. Can... You don't need to be known. You just need to just wreck that person super fucking hard so they do remember <laughs> you. That's how you get famous. That's no, how like, you get famous. What I'm yeah. saying is like, if you try and do something when you're famous and it doesn't work out. You look bad. If you do it as like a no-name person, then oh whatever, you're just another scrub. It's yeah. fine. Nice. I don't know. Try something epic. I think any news is good news, man. So if you get people talking about you, you know, get about hyped. this one thing that Troy fucking did to this one like this one team. Pizza hype. Yeah. What? <laughs> uh, uh, one of the streams we were doing, we ordered pizza. And we we're like, get hyped, pizza hype. <laughs> oh my god, pizza hype. Oh, yeah. And then people are people are hyped for pizza. Dude. Okay. Well, we'll talk about more hype next time on Nostalgia Bros. Get get hyped for next episode. Hype.